Well, today is the grand reopening of the Varsity Cinema. The cinema has been a staple of the Drake neighborhood since 1938, but it closed back in 2018. But now, thanks to donations from the community, it is back and ready to entertain. Our Griffin Wright joins us live this morning with more on this. Hey, Griffin, good morning. Good morning, Kaylin. So it really took the support of the entire community to make this happen. Des Moines Film, it's the nonprofit that owns the theater now. They say they that a thousand people all contributed to the funds to kind of put forward to make this uh, theater pay for the renovations and really get it up and running again. And really the Varsity Theater, it's a smaller theater and it provides that venue for those other films other than those huge IMAX blockbusters that you see. Now, Des Moines has a rich and storied history in film, and the new Varsity Cinema is paying homage to that with a historic Des Moines film tribute wall. They've also added a second smaller theater to the cinema, which gives them more options for showing films. And with their snazzy renovations, they'll be able to provide the best viewing experience for art films, something that's been a part of Des Moines Films' vision for the cinema since the start. The big difference between us and the other, you know, movie theaters that people think about in town, we're, we're a film arts nonprofit. We're an arts organization. So we have very intentional programming that says, what can we bring to this community? You know, what can we, we bring here that's going to grow the film culture here? So yes, we're looking at, you know, what is artistically significant? What are those voices that aren't gonna be seen in this community if we don't bring that here? What are some community partnerships that we can create there? Screening of Singing in the Rain tonight that sold out and also a screening of the uh, Lost Cinemas of Greater Des Moines and also uh, the movie Decision to Leave. And they're just going to have more and more movies throughout the coming years and years and years. Hopefully uh, it's always going to be open. You can check online and find uh, what showings are coming up. And it's really that perfect venue for those uh, smaller films or those art films that really the kind of the Des Moines area has been missing for a while. So you have those smaller cinemas where you can really just get those uh, unique experiences and that you wouldn't have at some huge, massive IMAX theater complex. I think the Varsity Theater is just one of the greatest places. I am so glad that it is coming back. And uh, yeah, Griffin is right. I have been there many times. Ooh. Uh, I've uh, taken dates there in college, going way, way back. I've gone, I think I've just gone by myself from time to time. And I used to go with friends. It's a, it's a destination. It's just a cool, cool place to go. 